I'm Ken Munshine, this is my student Brian Larkin, and I want to show you a little concept with rapier and with distance and with timing. And let's, well, let me show you the, the basic scenario. So we're here, our basic rapier scenario. We're both on guard. Brian steps in, he finds my blade, and of course, from there he can hit me. This is sort of the basic rapier setup. Every master discover, talks about this. However, everyone also talks about what to do about this. Capo Fowler, for instance. As Brian steps in, I hit him. Because as he's entering distance, he gives me a tempo and I can hit him. But of course, I also talk about counters to this. And what I want to talk about is how to set up that counter. And this is something actually that I got from modern fencing coaching. Um, Rob Handelman talks about this, Bucky Leach talks about this. It's the idea of a half step, this sort of provocative step. And regular masters talk about similar concepts. They talk about narrow stances, wide stances, but essentially something's going to happen in that two, -tempo, two tempo step into distance and I'm going to hit Brian. And of course this is very, very similar also to that long short video we uh, posted as well. So here, here's the basic idea. Brian takes a half step into distance. If I do nothing, it can finish and hit. Okay? This is just for drilling purposes. This is for observation. If he takes a half step in, and I try to attack, there's his counterattack. Same way if he doesn't quarter. He steps in, half step, proceeding with the foot, uh, proceeding the hand with the foot again. And, and half step, there's the attack, and turn your hand over. There you go. Again. Let's do that properly now. Extend half step. And there you go, I'm moving up one. There's this counterattack. So what that looks like all together is half step, there we go, and I'm hit. Half step, I do nothing, follow up, right? If I do do something in that tempo, by the way, I'm likely going to be behind the tempo. He can always do something else. He can always add to that, for example. So half step, I do nothing, finish. Oh, I'm late! Right? And he's going to add a little, little step there to get out of the way, whatever he likes. Half step, bump, oh, it's carry, but Brian can continue that attack, take it back, and maybe within Cortez, something like that. Again, half step, I was doing, oh, I'm late, and there, he takes it back, because he's, he's always going to be a tempo ahead, because um, I'm reacting. Again, half step, I attack, too late, sorry, my bad, again, half step. Uh, which way? You went towards the sword. Yeah. Look. Again. Half step. Step off. Uh, there you go. One more time. Half step. Step off. Good. Half step. I do nothing. Finish. Half step. I do nothing. Oh, I've done something. He takes it back. So that can form the basis. Whoops. That can form the basis for a very good options drill. Not just like that. Uh, it's an idea. <laughs>